Hi and good day. It's Ed over at Antique Toys. Today we have a Frisbee patent walking beam toy review to do real quick. So stay tuned for more. Cheers from Ed over at Antique Toys. Let's get into it. This is a Watt Beam, a James Watt Beam or Walking Beam designed steam toy. That's right. You give a kid a burner, a pressure vessel, probably alcohol in the burner, and then you get a steam toy to start spinning with the walking beam. And the pressure is going to fill up this piston and you're going to get rolling. But first we'll look at the aesthetic. All right, the aesthetics. We've got a crown with a kind of a fleur-de-lis kind of floral, maybe Art Nouveau design. This was hands painted. You got painted green with gold. And the toy ends up being mounted on what they call a plinth. Plinth being this wooden base. Infinitely practical. You've got double screws you can put on each foot. and then mount it. Patent is done by Frisbee. And you can see James Frisbee, F-R-I-S-B-E. And you can see on this side is patent. Frisbee held the patent and J.E. Stevens appears to have done the work. Uh, this walking beam is cast iron, cast iron, cast iron, iron here. And then we have a real primitive and interesting uh, dare I say blow off valve here we'll take a look here quite possibly a blow off valve here so if your pressure vessel got too high it comes out um, we'll take a look at the flywheel real quick the flywheel I think is quite interesting because of this the angles uh, I find a lot of the earlier steam engines do that a lot of times they do hand pinstriping, which this one has. And then they've got a wire, which runs across to what ends up being a valve. So valve would be open, closed, right, left, open, closed, open, closed, open, closed. And the valve would release the steam from this vessel in to the piston. The piston would drive up so the piston would drive up, put energy into the flywheel, and then the flywheel would keep the momentum and do work, like if you're an engineer you'd say it does work, do work right here into this pulley. And the pulley would then connect, let's say, to a saw, to a, uh, a man, a paper, diagram or toy that moves. Um, it was a bit of a novelty. The whole point was to make it move just like mom, dad, grandpa's toy moved. Alright, so there you have it, a Frisbee designed circa 1880 steam engine that would have a burner below it, which would be like methylated alcohol, to drive a Watt, James Watt beam, walking beam, uh, so it's a steam engine, but it's so primitive, so overbuilt, a lot of iron in it that it's definitely worth enjoying. So cheers from Ed. If you have steam toys this old or let's say the early 1900s and such, please talk to us. We're happy to help out. Toys at AntiqueToys.com and check out our details. Take care.